Alright, so let's go ahead and get right into the video. Hold up. Before, before we start. Go ahead and flip the lights on your Yes, sir. Let's get right. You need that, bro? You need it back? Yeah, bro. You need it back. All right, bro. We're going to be looking at some of the scariest videos. Bro, 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 and I suggest that you don't watch this at night. But if you are going to anyways, I have a challenge for you. Try to press and make it to the very end of this video. I know, bro. I'm too glad. Hey, you see? Bro, y'all can see my glasses, but they look like hot. Keep it in. A man is all by himself when he hears a wild animal tearing through his home. Eventually, he corners it in the bathroom and cautiously enters with a camera. This is, is what he reports moments before running to the police. Why I hate when they do this, bro. A wide-eyed humanoid Did, slowly strikes out the the wide-eyed humanoid. <laughs> the uploader says it's hard to tell if this was a human or not. And evident from genetic... Bro, is that another one? Oh, that's the doorknob. Suggested. You stupid. This video comes from an English establishment called the Lamb and Lion Inn. A server is cleaning a table while the ghostly co worker shows up late to work. Look at the door what? And see it. A small strand of light soon expands into a white broom pushed by two floating hands. The server walks by without even noticing. Do you I think wish that's I was really on the camera. Boy, I'm sorry, shooting. Or something else altogether. <gasps> if you're enjoying the video so far, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Two minutes in. Number nine. A YouTuber named Dan Baines is the keeper of Mr. Fritz, a ventriloquist dummy that was once used to entertain the troops during the 1940s. He's very old and has since fallen apart to the point where all that remains is his disembodied head. Mr. Fritz is believed to be possessed by the spirit of his creator, a man who lost his life in battle and refuses to rest in peace. Lately, Dan has been seeing and hearing things all around antiques, so he sets up a camera to record. It's 3.30 in the morning. Whoa! What a open. As you no, can see, fate, there are no strings on the no way, bro. This it's happens again there, at around the same time opens. the next night, except this time, his eyes open. String or no string, watch this part and tell me how a wooden ventriloquist dummy can open its eyes with no one nearby. And if you zoom in for a closer Fish look, you'll see hole. two orbs oh, race by shortly after the case opens. I'm not saying that this video is impossible you to fake, that, but unless this is really an what, electronic prop like that's been controlled with a remote, oh, then bro. I don't see how it can be done. Now the piece of done, bro. A man creeps up on an unsuspecting woman as she enters her code into an ATM, laying low until she enters her pen and then taking over the transaction by force, nudging her out of the way to make an involuntary withdrawal. He is completely unconcerned with getting caught and wears no disguise whatsoever as the woman struggles from her car to stop him. He later repeats the plan again, hiding out of sight until the last second and then leaping into the person's car to go after the large wad of cash in their hand. The fact that he was doing this during broad daylight shows that there was no safe time to be at an ATM. So you have to be constantly on guard. Why you walked up Number like that? Number seven. A YouTuber named Steve Hugh records what he suspects oh, no, could bro. be a paranormal sighting at the what Lonely House. Bro, what's coming down the stairs, bro? I'm saying. A spirit like, descends the steps and then continues to walk in mid-air. Bro, you see, you see the shadow. Bro, you see the shadow, bro. Y'all, you see. You got a on my neck like that. Like, what the what? Some people but think that this is some box, kind of hologram box, projection, yeah. while others say that this is real. If you've ever been to the Longley House in England, let us know if this is just a tourist attraction so we can settle the rumors once and for all. Number 6. A ghost hunting YouTube channel called Spartan Hunters 2 explores the narrow oh, stone corridors of the old Paulding County Jail in Ohio for any signs of the afterlife. As soon as they turn the corner, they hear something that sends shivers down my spine. I hate it when it when it go like that. Did you hear that? What was that? Wow. An anguish scream cries out from deep within the jail complex, which I'm sure most of you have heard, but did you hear the creepy laughter that follows the scream? Listen really closely and you can make out the faint echoes of laughter bouncing off the walls. It happens right after he says, Did you hear that? Did you hear that? This video was taken by a Redditor's father while they were walking around an old historic building. He claims to have been all alone in the room, and according to the Redditor, their father is a very serious man who doesn't lie about such things. So even though he is alone, he records someone standing next to him in a reflection of the case. They cross yeah, behind him and then are instantly gone. 
and when he looked back at the video, he saw the arm and blue shirt of someone standing in front of him. I guess this video could be very easy to stage, but I don't think the Redditor would lie about something like this though. Perhaps if this historic building has CCTV, Bruh, that, we could that possibly is get another angle another person, of this event right? to finally solve the mystery. Oh, no, Number 4 <laughs> This door sounds like a witch, and I'm not even exaggerating. Would you be able to live in a How house that made this noise? Like... <laughs> I'm not going that far, but I'm saying that if any part of my house even sounds remotely like this, I'm definitely going to move away. Number three. I'm definitely going to move away. A YouTuber away. named Exploring with Perks is no checking mind. out an old abandoned home of one of the oh, creepiest basements he has map. ever seen. Possible remains rest outside of an old hole in the wall, with the rest of the body possibly on the other side as well. And later on, he finds remnants of what mm -hmm. I hope is just a stuffed animal, mm -hmm. and then he gets some facts. Don't touch it, bro. Don't touch it, bro. Ha! Gay! What are you gay? What you talking about, bro? Dude, feeling like meat engine? It's kind of gay, bro. Nah, you count, nah. It's kind of gay, bro. Nah, but you. But what that is, bro? But what that is? Bro, I know you see that. It's a penis! Ha 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 ha